these people that looked after these apartments, they were believers, so it didn't bother them. You know, all the furniture I gathered from different different units that were, were left. And uh, they had their own place to stay in. And, and I thank God that, you know, he puts it in my heart, you know, to, to so love to people that, that need it. And a lot of times when I, when, when negativity comes in, you start, you start thinking about um, all these people that are in the streets today. You know, you, you wonder, you know, how can you help them? But the only one way that I know is to, to go out there and, uh, you know, greet them and give them, give them something to eat and uh, warm clothes, especially in the winter time. My youngest daughter, my youngest daughter, for the first time we moved to Prince George, the first time she seen a street person, she cried. And so I said, you got, you got to be bold enough to go out there and, and let them know that you love them and go start feeding them. So that's what we did. I did that in Prince Rupert when I was living there. And it's it's a good feeling to know that, you know, some of them change their lives after a while when you saw that love to them. I had five families that, that um, changed their lives because, you know, somebody told them he loved them. I told them God loves you. You know, I love you too. If I didn't care, I would be here to help you. And this one family, I, I, I really saw me. They were in the verge of committing suicide together because they had nowhere to go. For 10 years, they lived in a, in a little shed. When I met them, I, I invited them to the street church. They didn't even know there was a street church where they get fed. Six months later, they, they started serving God. The youngest one in the family said, God is real. He's real. Or we won't be here today. Because their dad was going to turn the van on, put all of them in there, put a hose into their, their van. But God had better plans. Amen. He had plans for that family. Amen. He saved them. And I thank God he put me in that spot to be able to, to talk with him. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. God bless you. to sing that song again and um, 